The biggest component of holistic dentistry is mercury removal. What drives a lot of people in for consultations is their fear about the harm that the very toxic element mercury can cause throughout their body. A good resource is by Dr. Tom McGuire. There's some books on mercury fillings and mercury filling removal if you're interested in learning more about it. But mostly what it boils down to is that mercury fillings are 55% mercury and 9% silver and there's some other elements in there like copper and tin. They're commonly called silver fillings because of their silver color. However, the main component is mercury. The main concern that people have is that the mercury is released when they're chewing by the expansion and contraction of the mercury filling with hot foods, cold foods, it'll actually off-gas a little bit of the vapor, which is then inhaled by you. So people want their fillings removed because they're concerned about how the mercury can create other problems throughout their entire body. I can consult with you on that. Actually, I think the biggest issue is that they crack teeth. Mercury is a very rigid material that's packed into the inside of a tooth. What ends up happening is your enamel which supports the filling, ends up having to flex every time you chew, and that flexure over time will create thousands of micro fractures, and at times, huge fractures within your tooth. These fractures can lead to root canals and oftentimes crowns, as the enamel will literally crumble around the silver filling. So a lot of what we do here in the office is removing the mercury filling very safely with a very specific protocol so that you don't inhale or swallow any of the mercury. And then we replace it with a biocompatible material which is almost identical to your own enamel. It's called lithium disilicate or otherwise known as Emax. It's a very strong material, it's beautiful, and it's tooth-like, but it also protects your tooth and tends to bond together those fractures so that you don't end up losing your tooth.